are the center back pairing. And this is a Charlotte side that has dealt with a bevy of injuries. But as Mike Jeffries has told us time and time again, he is not a side, he is not a coach who makes excuses. I think it looks nice, but practically, I don't like. Here's Ferris on the other end. Dykstra with a big save. Back out in front, and the shot sent over the bar. Well, as we're talking about fashion, Farish trying to find his way into the score sheet. And then Galena. Michi Galena to the outside, puts a shot on Dykstra again. It's Chambers blocked in front. Chambers once more, and Bethlehem have their goal in the seventh. Fool me once, but you're not going to fool me twice. Chambers gets Bethlehem off and running here at the Sportsplex at Matthews. 1-0 to Brendan Burke's side. The composure from Chambers, but this, this is all made there from Galena on the outside. Does everything right. As you see, look, controls that first volley inside of his foot, and then the second one, he... Comes a little magician the other way. Moar. Finding Holness. Holness lets it fly. It's off the post. Loves these types of situations from the dead ball. He's gonna put it on frame, it's off the post! Not sure if Dykstra got a touch to it, but that's two woodworks for Bethlehem in the past two minutes. Maris a heavy touch. Chambers, Skundrich, clever to find Moar. Moar takes it and Dykstra parries it away. Olivier Baizo trying to get around, just muscles vines off the ball. Baizo still with it, there it is! It's Holness. The Bethlehem Steel double their lead late in this one here at the Sportsplex at Matthews. Pure creation from Olivier Baizo, and it's 2 0 to the visitors. So he slowly puts his foot on it here, and he just draws in Vines and Vines. He gets his body in Vines, and then just just gets out muscled by Baizo, and he pulls it back. It's a great finish there. Nanko. Skundrich. Over for Moar, back for Skundrich. It's scintillating stuff from Bethlehem. They waltz down Broadway. Carries on his run, lovely little outside, carries on his run. I love that from the midfielder and then gets his reward. They simply cannot get it done. And the Bethlehem Steel with a 3-0 win in their last three games. They have 10 goals for, just one against, nine straight points for Brendan Burke's side, and they now leapfrog the Indy 11 into sixth place in the Eastern Conference.